Welcome to sunny Lagos. Um, end of an era today. Cyril's having his last day of work for us. Um, he needs to go away, have a have a good time, do whatever he wants to do. Um, and you know, it, it's time for a maybe a different challenge for me and different challenge for him. So I'm going to have to look for a new uh, apprentice as such. And uh, and he's going to go away, like I say, have a, have a bit of a rest. Um, there was a question uh, in the last vlog about where we were taking all of the stone. So I'm just going to show you. Here's all the stone I've brought back from Vilnav so far. We've got a few more trips to do. And uh, basically it's just gone along the driveway at Lagos for the time being and um, before the season starts all of this I'm going to have to move with my uh, bobcat so just take them back into storage so it's nice and cleaned up ready for the wedding season so we're going to get straight off to Vilnav now and get a couple of loads back uh, last few loads of stones from from Vilnav and uh, then we're going to work all day and of course I've got my uh, map that I've done for Cyril to give him and a few other bits and bobs to give him uh, to say thank you for his time with us. Hello everyone, I've just arrived in Vilnav. Ed and Cyril have been going non-stop. The kids are back in school, well Charles is back in school and I's back in crash so I can start helping. We have beautiful weather so we're trying to do as much as we can. So the place, well, most of the outside can be done and it's looking really good. I mean, beautiful blue skies, not a cloud at all. And it's, there's lots going on. So let's go and have a look at what Cyril and Ed are up to. Just arrived. So we've had to take all of those semi well, the, the circular stones away, haven't we? Yes. Because it's looking more and more like we're not going to keep here and we're going to sell. And you don't want to lose those stones, you want to no. keep them because they're so nice. Yes. These here are a different story though. What is the story about these? Well, these we're leaving here because I need to choose out of these four two. Oh because I'm gonna go back and change something. Before I put the, uh, before I put the, the kind of tiles on top of this wall, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go back and that lintel that was a bit low, we're gonna put an arch there instead. Oh, that is really nice. That is such these a- are, These are really hard stones, so they'll do really good. Yeah. That is really good. I like that. Yeah, so just for the time being, I'm leaving those. We've cleaned up all of this area now with Cyril's last day. We thought we'll try and get as much of the hard graft done. Mm -hmm. uh, we're mixing a bit of concrete and I'll go and show you where we're up to over there as well. Uh, yeah, it's all go, isn't it? And then we've got rain coming. So we're trying to get as much done outside as we can before the rain comes. Exactly. Because we need to, I mean. And that's why we stopped on the kitchen, yeah? Yes. Definitely, because we can do the kitchen when... When it's raining. Yeah. yeah, but we can't do outside work when it is heavy rain. 
Yeah, I mean, you've got a few stones lying around, but they're just kind of rubble stones. They're just going to get like, taken back and left because they're no use. Um, but yeah, it's all pretty much cleaned up here. I think the stones that everyone was saying, oh, you should leave them here to do uh, uh, kind of uh, borders for flowers. Mm -hmm. I think we are going to leave them here. I think I'm just going to put them over there where the, where the trees are in, in the woods there. Mm -hmm. Um, if they want to use them, they can use them. Otherwise, they just gather moss over there. And yeah. Not hurting anyone, really, is it? So. No. Well, yeah, I mean, we're almost clear. We are. And then we'll be ready to level off the ground. That's going to be one of the last things we do, because I have to prepare all of the, um, the path in over there, ready for concreting as well, mm -hmm. before I actually level everything. Well, I'll get somebody in to come and level everything up. So, unfortunately, Mount Ed is here for some time to come. Well, one day soon, Mount Ed will be gone. Yeah. Hi, Ed. I see something beautiful and shiny. Well, yeah, I didn't get a chance to film it for you because uh, Denny was panicking one day and I had to do drop everything. Uh, basically, he wanted to put the boiler in. Oh. So the boiler's now in. Mm-hmm. Is that But the... before the boiler went in, I had to get some of the plasterboard up. Mm-hmm. So it's all looking nice and neat now. He's He's gone away for lunch again. <laughs> I was going to say, <laughs> where is it? Um, and he's going to finish off the boiler. Uh, but I thought it'd be interesting to see how we're doing the insulation and plasterboarding and everything because you kind of bare bones. Normally we wouldn't do it like this. Normally we do insulation, then move on to plasterboard, then move on to this. Like this. So here you get to see exactly how it's going down. Here we've got uh, what they call is isolation mass, so it's like multiple thin insulation, thin insulation. but very. They... But it's it's a really expensive. Well, not really expensive, but really good quality one because it has uh, uh, wool in it. Mm -hmm. So you got all those layers with basically put a baton on the wall, stapled this to the baton, and mm -hmm. then we just pretend that that's all something else or whatever, and we just do a, a, a kind a of high ra rails. Uh, rails and, uh, plasterboard. and plasterboard with insulation in between, so phonic insulation, mm -hmm. because you've only got about that much. It, it, it insulates a bit, but it's not much use. So yeah, basically, uh, that's how we're going to be doing it down here. The, uh, but the... Uh, the ceiling is not going to be like that. The ceiling's going to be, it already has this mm -hmm. underneath the tiles. And then we're going to put some rock wall, maybe 20 centimeter rock wall mm -hmm. up on the ceiling too. Perfect. So yeah, um, here's the uh, heater. Mm -hmm. Let's... What's going on? Denise had my new blinking ladders. I was going to say, those look I, bright. I treated myself to a new set of ladders. Are oh, you? Yeah. I think it was 50 euros and he's had them. Of course he has, he wants the best things. Talk of the devil, he's back, you're gonna have to stop doing it. No, no, I'm just gonna film the machine, not Denny. I won't disturb, I won't disturb him. I like the new machine and the fact that he managed to get it when it was very hard to get. Yeah. Yes, just like it. Denny's here and his son. So you want to Denny's house? Uh -huh. yeah, okay. Don't, uh, yeah, so he's really lucky that he managed to get it basically. But it is a very good brand, so I had to pay a little bit more for it. But at least we got it, and it's it's going to be uh, it's going to be finished on time. That's yeah. the main thing. That's the best. Oh, Like father, like son, Ed. Yeah, well, Charles has prepared it. I just had one <laughs> one uh, side to take off. Because you need that. Uh... Yeah, we're going to put some bricks on it. Just clear up this area here so there's nothing left. Only the tiles. And...
Now, I've seen the, the cement mixer going and I know you've been doing other jobs. But what's going on here, Ed? Okay, so the drive-in's coming this way. Mm -hmm. um, garage is here. Mm -hmm. uh, we've put the garage a bit higher with a, with a fall towards the front of the garage. Um, but here I'm setting a uh, drain. I can't remember the exact term for it in English. Probably different in American and Australian anyway. But we set this drain a little bit lower. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have quite a bit of a fall. Really, you wouldn't normally do it as much as we're doing. But uh, we're gonna have quite a bit of a fall down to this. So basically, the water's gonna come away from the building. There's no chance of it going in the building. There is a bit of a fall coming back towards the building, which I really don't like, mm -hmm. but really have no choice. Mm. Uh, there will be a fall towards the hedge as well, um, towards the garden over there. So really, it shouldn't be too much of a problem, but look at the depth of this. Wow. It, it's gonna be fine, it'll take any water that we want. Yeah. So what I'm doing now is I'm laying this in mm -hmm. level, yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's so where you have it. lower, the... but it's level. And yeah. then when I get to where I want my tube coming out, I mm -hmm. just literally uh, connect, you see that hole there? I just punch that hole through. Oh, okay, let me see that hole oh, there. Yeah, there, so uh -huh. I punch that hole through and the water goes away into my soak away. Okay. So basically that just slots in there. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's really important that they stay level because it's kind of a, see I've gone too deep there. Talking too much. Oh no, it's just I'm distracting you because I wanted to know what you were doing. So it's, it's got, obviously we don't want them like that either. So you have to keep your eye on both height mm -hmm. and uh, direction. I think I'm fairly good there. Mm -hmm. I think I'm quite level, so I'll just check with them. Slightly down there, that's going to have to come back up again, but that's fine. So there you go, yeah, we've got eight of those to do. Mm -hmm. And then that's the garage protected from rain. Yeah. And I'm going to take it straight to my soak away. So, yeah. So there's no regard because they're open. Pipe anyway. there, and then your soak away is over yeah. there. Okay. Well, the pipe might have to be over here because I've still got to get my uh, um, tank in around this joint that um, Denny's done. Did. done. Yeah. Cyril, you're going to be able to do tomorrow. He's saying yes. Eddie's got just his last mix to do now. Cyril is taking his little break because he's finished. And then you'll be going. Yeah. So, Cyril, I've made you something. I'm going to take something. Maybe you'll be able to do it. It's a card for France. It's a card for France for that, right? Yes. Yes, yes. Like that, you can see it on the phone. Yes, yes, yes. Like that, you can see it. You can see it. It's the other ones. Yes, I see it. You're not obliged to guard it. If you don't, you don't take it. 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 But I have French in there. No camion. C'est le cadeau empoisonné, hein. <rire> tu sais, si t'inquiète, il a passé un temps pas possible, mais bon. Non, j'ai hésité hier. J'avais collé, en fait, tu peux mettre les petits points. Ah oui, d'accord. Si tu veux. C'est bon. C'est bon. C'est bon. Mais tu peux donner... Nous avons un petit quelque chose d'autre pour Cyril, mais c'est... Nous avons déjà pris le temps pour le lunch, nous avons déjà donné des cookies et des choses, donc... Oui, et oui, et quelque chose d'autre, et c'est un présent extra que il a mérité, parce qu'il a été avec nous pendant très longtemps. Merci beaucoup, Cyril. Merci beaucoup, Cyril. Merci beaucoup, Cyril. Oh, bah tiens. Tu veux te rendre... Tu veux te rendre... Ah, non, je t'ai fait un bisou. Bon. Merci beaucoup. Merci, mon petit. Merci, Cyril. Non, on fait comme... Merci beaucoup.
Oui, c'est dit, de toute façon, je reviens. Euh... Non, demain, je suis là encore. Oui. Chris n'est pas Après, je reviens. Stay one more night. Mais il n'est pas travaillé. Il est resté. Il est resté maintenant. Bon. Okay. Bon, merci beaucoup. Merci à toi, petit chat.